Happy homecoming. <laughs> this is Queen Sandy Fredrickson, right? Yes. Yes, happy homecoming. 1975. Good for you for saying that. You look fantastic. What a fun day though, huh? It is fun. <laughs> Year's King Queen. Oh, from Lake Mills. King. Oh, yeah. Oh, those are very close to our neck of the woods. Yeah. Come watch Derby next year. Oh, to Derby? Oh, Derby. Rolling Derby. Nice. Oh, oh, oh. Nice candy throw. Nice one. Yeah. Woo. Fun. The year of community. Why is the vehicle there? Actually, actually, they were getting rid of theater when I was here, and I'm glad it's back. I was a worker player. Can I have candy? Oh yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Candy. Hey, pretty. Okay, this is the king. Remind me of your name again? Lou. And what did I just tell you about what I liked about you? You said you liked my dreads. I do like your dreads. Yep, your husband told me to keep them forever. So. Exactly. <laughs> That's good advice, King. What are you going to do during your role this year? During my role? Yeah. Um, I'm not for sure we yet. We just hope graduate. <laughs> There's Dad. Yeah, let's get that. That's a good thing. Good we thing. just hope he graduates. Have a fantastic year. What do you see? <laughs> what do you think about that? <laughs> Yeah, that's all. Just that one. That was very funny. What did you say? Well, it must be the very beginning. No, not the very beginning. Somewhere in the middle. Yeah. Isn't that cool? Hey, look who I saw. Don Meyer. Right here in Hartford. Right here at Woodford. Who would have thought? Who would have thought? He used, we used to kid him around, uh, kid around with him about um, clinging to his old typewriter, you know, that typewriter that he had on his desk. And, and um, he, as he was hunting and pecking on this new Apple computer, you know, as his laptop. So beyond the naming rights and the contributor plaques and all of our speeches and the great looking cake over there, Grant's memory will live on in our hearts. To those he taught, those he guided, and those he loved, Grant was a sower of seeds, and now Wartburg is benefiting from his heart. I never had the opportunity to take any of Grant's courses, um, and because of that, I can't help that I think I missed out on learning something special. In my three and one quarter years here at Warburg, <laughs> I've realized something about professors and what they're teaching. When the, per when the person teaching you has seen and done as many things as Grant had, they, they know what they're talking about. You're, you know you're going to learn something from them, there's no doubt. But what makes the lessons memorable and what makes the students eager and willing to learn and try new things is the teacher and his or her relationship with the students. It really must be something special because from the time I walked on campus, he's just referred to as Grant. <laughs> and people just say, well, Grant did this, and Grant did that, and Grant wanted this, and Grant wanted that. And finally I said, well, okay, who's Grant? <laughs> His leadership here, and I think more than leadership, his inspiration, the inspiration he leaves with all of us, and that inspiration that uh, influences generations of students whom he never met, and uh, many more down the road whom he will never Three of the, three of the regents uh, who adopted his work, invested in me by the Warburg College Board of Regents, I hereby name the Grant Price Studio and the McElroy Communication Arts Center in recognition and in memory of Grant L. Price. Nicole, Mark was the only person to give you a what? An A minus. An A minus? I know. Mark is responsible for your A minus. Oh no, how are you? It's good to see you. You too. I still don't quite recognize you without the ponytail, but I you know, know. I'm. Sometimes I'm I don't either, Nicole. I know. I'm getting there, yeah. And you know what? She still remembers that A minus, Mark. I do. I do. <laughs>
<laughs> it's not funny. That's the first question she asked. Mark, it's not funny. It is funny. Oh, it is no. funny. Okay, good. It's good. We got to see we got to see your Take mommy and daddy when they were dating. Yep. They were That's pretty right. cool when they were dating. We actually, yeah, we met, we met in the class. So I went last time I went. I just, I just couldn't How are you? How are you, Michael? <laughs> I know. Did you see my name on the flag? Yeah. Is that a big deal? Oh yeah. Is it? The mag at our house. I have a plaque like it, don't I, at our house? Yeah. We go now. Yeah. Let's go down and see those jugglers down there, Stras. I, I, I just. The Renaissance. We had wondered about the horse, didn't we? Went the night. Now, first of all, who was in the night? Kyle Yeager was in the night costume today. Kyle. For the parade, but not for the Renaissance Fair. His friend Jordan was in okay. the, the night for the Renaissance Fair. And the horse is in Wisconsin with a lovely orange braid through the black horse's mane oh. and glitter on the horse, all ready to come to Warper Grove. Oh, horse, all dressed up with no place to go because no what happened? To go because the truck had to be used for something else. The truck that would normally pull the trailer that had the horse inside that would come to work for homecoming. They're working on it for next year. But the person that braided the horse's braid with the yeah. complete with the orange ribbon yeah. also braided Kyle's braid uh, for inside the night costume. Yeah, yeah isn't that convenient? Yeah, and there must be a thing with long hair this year because did you know the dreads on the king? Yes. Yeah, well, and, and you Lake know, Mills. yes, and the king's dad it would be Bill Peters who was here when we were here. I know. <laughs> I got an interview yes. with him. And you oh, know, cool. okay, and. I like men with long hair. Yeah. <laughs> because I was married to one for 16 years. Yeah, and so. then he cut it off. I, I so figured. Does she still love me? Yeah. Yes, she still loves you. Of course she still loves you. <laughs> I do. You told him to cut it? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> sure. Trust. I think there's a secret to success must be in the hair. I just don't let Delilah get at it. Oh, of course. Oh, Were you Teddy? Yes. Teddy, Teddy had a charged up San Juan Hill or something. Oh, that's right. To play Charge. With <laughs> I must call a cabinet meeting. <laughs> Very Renaissance fair looking. We do with Boo. And his lovely wife Renee isn't here today. Tell her hi, please. Hello, Renee. And tell her, Renee, we talked a lot about you. We did actually talk a fair amount about you. Yeah, I wish I could hear more though, but from her it'd be more fun. <laughs> Yay, good to see you. All right, good to see you. Tower Agency, the student-run public relations firm. And what it, PR? What, yeah, PR. Really? And tell, let, have, tell her, have her tell what I just did. She got her very first bean bag in the hole, which means she won a t-shirt. <laughs> Let's see if I can, if I do it again, do I get another t-shirt? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh. PR tested. You are PR tested. I PR tested. I am. I am far from PR testing.